How to select a niche product to promote the smart way. A lot of ClickBank marketers fail because they don't know how to pick the right niche. They end up putting in a lot of time, effort, and energy only to lose interest, market to non-existing demand, and otherwise commit a range of rookie mistakes. If you don't want that to happen to you, follow the steps below to the letter. Step one, list out your personal interests. Right off the top of your head, write down your personal interests. These should be topics that you love talking about and are so interested in that you would talk about them even if you're not getting paid. Come up with a long list. As long as you're truly interested in these topics, write them down. Step number two, filter by demand, search volume. Go to Google AdWords and create an account if you don't already have one. Once you're logged in, click Tools and use Google's Keyword Planner tool. Enter in keywords that are related to the personal interests that you have listed in step one. You should be able to find lots of related keywords to these interests and download these because they will have search volumes next to the keywords. At this point, you're going to delete from your list niches or personal interests that have too little search volume or are too much. You want something in the middle. Step number three, filter by competition. Now that you have a shorter list of niches to filter, the next step is to enter their keywords into Google's main search box. When you enter a search phrase into Google, you will get results, but at the top left corner, Google will inform you how many pages target that search phrase. Take note of this number and write them down next to each niche keyword. Once you have entered all your relevant niche keywords into Google, eliminate from your list niches that are too competitive. These are niches that have too many pages targeting them. I'll leave this up to you. It all boils down to your comfort level. Some people are comfortable with a tremendous amount of competition. Other people would like something more manageable. I'll leave this up to you so you call the threshold level. Maybe you can deal with 1 million pages. Perhaps you are more ready at ease with 300,000 or less pages. Whatever the case may be, apply it uniformly across all the niches you have left on your list. Step number four, enter your keywords into ClickBank Marketplace and pick by relevance. Now that you have a fairly short list of niches, pick the top three niches that you're most interested in. Enter their keywords into ClickBank's Marketplace and select products based on relevance. Usually, you should be able to find a product, but sometimes your niche may not show up. There might not be a product that's directly related to your niche. There might be something that's closely or somewhat related. Whatever the case may be, pick out as many products from the ClickBank Marketplace that are related to your niche. Step number five, promote all products at first. In the beginning, you should promote all the products you are able to retrieve using the niche selection process above. Your strategy is pretty straightforward at this point. Promote all the products at your site first and pick the top three winners. These are the products that convert the most. Focus on conversions. Don't focus on how much traffic they get. Traffic is worthless unless it converts. Always remember that. Pick the top three winners in terms of conversions and stick to those. Note, gravity is not really all that helpful because of different circumstances. I've already mentioned earlier on in this training why you shouldn't just select products based on gravity. Instead, get as many products that are directly related to your niche as possible and promote all those products. You're going to then filter them based on how successful they are.